Hi everyone. I look for a lot of the different secrets and mysteries from all around the world, looking for the coming of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, Emmanuel, the Son of God, who was raised from the dead and took all the sins of the world away. Now the world elite, the Illuminati, the Freemasons, and even the spiritual realms that are all around us, they leave their signs and secrets right in front of us, in symbolism. And on my channel, we bring all of this back to the Word of God and show how we're nearing the end of days. Well, today is September 1st, and we're going to take a look at the newest crop circle, which was found on in the UK on the 31st of August, here in Essex. Now, I'll leave the link to this site here. We've investigated nearly all of these crop circles, and all of the areas map out the end of the age coming, and whatever we can make of these different glyphs. This one over here has been associated with the compass and the square of the Freemasons, as well as with the sign of Aquarius, just as with all of the people doing the, the ice bucket challenge where they're dumping the water on their heads. And Jesus Christ mentioned that when we all go into the town, when we see the person with the pitcher of water, it's time to go to the upper room, which is basically the time to go to Ascension and go to the Feast of the Lamb, because that's where they had the Last Supper. It's the end of the age coming. Well, right here is these these two here. This one happened on the 24th, and this one here happened on the 29th. See, all of these are in Essex, and this one here was in Essex also on the 31st. Now, oops, sorry, that's me and my wife there, but right here on Google Earth, we've shown that all of the areas map out just as much as the crop circle itself that the whole world is as a grid playing out exactly by the Bible. And today we're going to show that this represents the time. See how we're being drawn over here? It's going to show when the head of the serpent is bruised, the grievous head wound of the Bible is coming. But down here you can see these, I've overlaid these three to four different crop circles. This one here, right here, was on the 24th. You can see how it looks like a target symbol and maybe even a full moon or excuse me maybe even like a quarter moon or even like an arc below it right here and then you can see that one there was the 24th and then we had this one here on the 29th this one right here we can see the I mean even like a solar system right in the middle and then something coming in well, we can break all these down as we go. We're going to get to show the area. And now we have this star and this pentagram and this, this geometric symbol all right here with something coming in. This is the newest crop circle on the 31st. Well, we can see that we're being drawn to this area, just as we've shown on all the other glyphs, or on, excuse me, on all the other areas where these are mapped out. And we've been able to see this guy right here. I'm not kidding, the whole world is like this. You see this serpent, even with this face, and we've seen this face right at the Vatican, just as we've shown like the Vatican is supposed to get hit, as well as the USA. See how it's a cross right here? It means we're at the time of the crossing. The, t the head of the snake is about to reach the tail of the snake. In the Bible, it's when the heel bruises the head at this point in time. And right here, this matches this glyph. See this individual coming down, and he has the key to open the abyss, and he goes through this sphinx like Obama, and does this large nuclear event, which we've tracked to the USA. And then the red horse of the apocalypse is off and running, meaning war. We're going to show a clip here at the end of this of the new show called Sleepy Hollow. It's actually its second season, and it's showing that the second horseman is ready to ride, called War. That show starts September 22nd, I believe. The number 22 comes up an awful lot. But you have to remember, Moses was taken out from underneath the burdens of Egypt and set free. All of these Egyptian things are supposed to be here. This is a burden, and we have to be set free. See this phoenix rising? That's the time of the rapture event for the wise virgins that are caught away. However you want to believe in this or not, at this time nuclear weapons will be being fired and going across the earth. So many people are going to be crossing no matter what we think or do. It's going to be the time of the crossing. 
So we can see this right here. See him? He's actually on the Illuminati box covers too. See right here? The head? This is an Illuminati box cover for the Illuminati card game. And it shows him wanting to get to the fifth age. Just as this guy has a V on his chest. See right there? Like a five? Right there. Him coming down. And then you can see this, the eagle flying away again. And then this idol warship coming. All right here. Which will be like with the mark of the beast and such. So there's the serpent. Right there. Now that we've laid our groundwork, there he is. See him right here? Perfect. Here's the hand of God hitting him, hitting him right in the head. Right there. Bam. The grievous head wound coming. And at this point in time is when they'll start doing this mark of the beast and giving out this thing. See this new type of Eucharist? Russia's all ready for this too. They've been prepared for this. The Russian Orthodox Church is a mimic replicant of the Catholic Church and it's all prepared for this. This is their new Eucharist with this where they're blending the DNA right there. He comes down. We'll see this guy here. He's getting his head wound. See the hand of God right there? And then you can see this guy right here getting this mark of the beast right here. See he's being made to eat that new type of Eucharist right here. Isn't it wild how the one crop circle here that looks, well any one of these crop circles would have looked like its eye. But they want to put this visor on everybody. They've shown this a lot. They're going to put this visor on them to actually worship the image of the beast. And it has a lot of things to do with this fin right at the top. See how he has like a little fin, a little point? Because it's the little horn of the Bible that comes and does all of this. So right there, that's what those crop circles are all meaning. That we're nearing the time of this grievous head wound event. This is the most recent crop circle. Please tell me what you think of this. This looks like some type of alignment. Something coming in. And we can actually see, even if we just stay simple, we can see right here this guy is getting, he is this serpent. Perfect. See the serpent? We can see him getting hit right in the head. And then we can see right here the mark of the beast coming. All perfect, all by scripture. So keep faith. This, this verifies God 100% that Jesus Christ is the only way. Call out to him. Confess with your mouth, the Lord is Jesus. Believe in your heart, God hath risen him from the dead, and you'll be saved. Hallelujah. May God have mercy on us all. I'm going to show that new clip for the new Sleepy Hollow coming, and they talk of opening the abyss and letting out the, the other entity from the bottomless pit. See that right there? The hand? Thank you very much, everybody. Only together can we stop the coming war. We need to fight with every breath that we have left. I'm not afraid of you. War has been here waiting all along. We have the means to create a weapon of unearthly power. We're talking about raising a monster. No choice. This is insane. I've done enough! War is hell.